is anime next day too. And for all ingrates out there who do not know the majesty that is Sesame Street, can you please tell us who you are? Me, Cookie Monster. Oh, good, you're in character. Awesome. Okay, now, you're, now um, is there a particular food you enjoy above any others? Is there, you know, something that you like? Is there, I'm, I ask this about everyone. What? What? Cookie. Cookie. Oh, okay. oh, that's okay. I'm starting to remember now. Okay, I was beaten as a child, so. Um, I, oh, thank you, thank you. Now, what do you say about, perhaps I think it was, a, we were just talking about, perhaps a couple years ago, they were talking about that Cookie Monster could no longer eat cookies because of the mass obesity problem that kids in this country were having. What do you say about that? Are you, do you, are you for it? Are you against it? Do you enjoy the, your, your, um, your veggie diet now? Do you prefer to be called Veggie Monster? Which, we have a story behind that. Oh, there's a story, okay. Mm. It's a tearjerker. <laughs> Parents blame me for making kids fat. Yeah. Me no buy cookies, me just eat them. Yeah. Not me, fuck. Yeah, you look pretty slim. You don't, you know, you don't have any weight problems or anything. You look fine, yeah. Me still eat the same amount of cookies, too. Yeah, but you, you, of course, you exercise, you jazzercise, you know, maybe you do some Pilates and stuff. Yeah. yeah. And see, that, that's, that's a lesson to all the kids out there. I was almost hit by a ball. Just, you know, just, just work out. You can enjoy cookies. Just go, you know, just run around outside. Dress up as your favorite anime character and run around on, in New Jersey. What are you taking my picture for? What the? Okay. Thank you very, I'm sorry, I went on a rant there. Thank you very much, Cookie Monster. That was great. Send my best to, to uh, what's that guy that lived in the garbage can? Not Big Bird. Oscar. Oscar the Greg. That was my favorite guy. I, He's a I, jerk. He is a jerk, that's why I love him. So for the purposes of this, uh, who are you and who are you cosplaying as? Um, my name is Nico Bellic. I'm new to America. Okay. It's, uh, it's been a little different around here. How different? I'm back where I'm from. We're not used to people being in uh, costumes like this. Oh, okay. It's, so this is how you normally dress? This is how I normally like to dress. Ever since I came to America, I've worked hard to get, you know, some money. Now, now what have you been doing here in America? How long have you been here? A few months with my cousin Roman. He, he owns a cab company. Oh, okay. You own a cab company? No, no, my cousin. I do different things to earn my money. Oh, okay. Can you explain what you do? That's kind of secret. Uh, no, I cannot explain. Uh, it tends to get me into trouble when I explain. Oh, okay. Do you like anime? Yeah. It, it is a... Uh, yes, it's interesting. It's, Why is it interesting? Uh, so many things. You see so many different things. Uh, the, what you never thought could happen before. It's, it's very nice. I like it. Oh, okay. Now, um, a friend of mine just had a baby, and she, uh, I don't know if you know her, her name is Jimmy Lynn Spears. Alrighty. Yes, and uh, she just had a baby girl. We're not sure what to name her. What would you suggest to name her? I would name her Katie, after a dear friend of mine who passed away. Oh, okay. Well, I'm sorry to hear about you, but thank you very thank much, you. sir. Welcome to America. Thank you, sir. I'm cosplaying as an original character, Vara Red, as in Variation Red. Okay, now have people confuse you with the Power Ranger? Yes, oh, definitely. Uh, now, do you get frustrated with that? or? Is no, this... I'm definitely Sentai inspired. Okay, now why this? Why not something else? Why not, we'll say, someone from Bleach? Because I like seeing uh, things. Uh, how can I put it? I like seeing live action um, costume stuff and it's it's a lot easier to see it when I see it in motion, so to speak, or even film. I'm just trying to replicate it. And there's never been one for the conventional. Okay, now speaking of this convention, do you like it so far? You Love it. The, uh, what is the one thing you're looking forward to? More people, more outfits. Yeah. Good analysis right there. Now, obviously, you're a fan of anime. If you wouldn't, you wouldn't be here. Right. Uh, why do you like anime? It is definitely something different. Um, I like a lot of the old school stuff because it's my introduction, obviously. But I like uh, the freedom that anime gives to uh, storytellers. Something that you couldn't necessarily make on film. <laughs> That's a, okay, good answer. I hope you can understand that. Yeah, I understood every single word. Okay. Now, um, 
Okay. One last question. Actually, a friend of mine, she just uh, gave birth to a baby girl yesterday. I don't know if you know her. Uh, her name is Jamie Lynn Spears, Britney Spears' little sister. Okay. Um, she just gave birth to a baby girl. We try to figure out what should we name her. Well, what, I'm going to you. What, what should we name Jamie Lynn Spears' baby? One had Aria. Any idea? Any name? What's her? Aria. Aria. Yeah. Why, oh, God. Why that? Aria. <laughs> What was that? Aria. Aria. Yeah. Why Aria? Because it's a nice, laid back kind of name. Shy guy. Okay. We're both Hammer Brothers. Dropping the hammer. Ba bong. Lakitu. Chris is pokey. Now why these guys? Why do I like Mario, Luigi, and Princess? Be cool. The villains are cooler. Okay. Everybody does Mario. Yeah. See Bowser around here? I hold all the information and I make sure everybody looks good. Okay, that's that what I do. So that's your job. So if these people look special, you touch them up real good. Yep. So if one of them was like, they lost their hair, or they like, just passed out, what's going to do to you? Well, everything. I do everything. Tech support's on top. Tech support. Of course. That's what I'm here for. That's security. You see the guns? The straps. So, you got, so if something happens to these guys, it's, it's on you. Oh, okay. You're just there to help. I'm in the middle, man. I'm, I take care of everybody. Alright, and what are you? I'm Brooke from One Piece. Beautiful. Alright, thank you. <laughs> My name is... I'm the Mad Hatter. His real name is... <laughs> I'm the Mad Hatter. My name is Alice. And that's it. That's who we are. Oh, okay, so why are you here at Anime Next? Because we have, a, we have a lot of fun and all of our friends are here. Yes. And I heard they had good tea. A wonderful tea. Yes, it was great tea. Earl Grey is very good. Earl Grey. Uh, uh, where, where do you suggest I get tea at? Um, well, a place near the courtyard. This, this is a place over there. If you go through the hotel, it's, it's um, there's, there's a whole it's bunch a of tickets. It's a lottery yes. ticket. Very delicious. Oh, okay. Now, did you guys did you guys come alone, or are you just no, are you no. with the others? Where's everybody else? Well, we, we have other friends here. We have other friends. But they're not from Wonderland. None of them are from Wonderland. They no. couldn't make it up the rabbit hole. You no. have no idea how hard that climb is. It's really difficult. Oh, okay. Now, a friend of mine just had a baby. She had a baby girl. Um, what should she name her? That's a good question. Let's go. I think... Hmm. I feel like you would say Regina. Regina would be a good, terrific name. Alice is a nice one too. Alice is no, a very, no, no. very nice girl name, name. Name very. her. Name her. Huh. I, I, I'm not good at names on the spot. Let me see. Let me see. The Queen. The Queen. Oh, oh the queen. you can name her the Queen. The Queen. Just name her the Queen. The Queen. The not Queen. queen. Alright, I will queen. let them know about that. Alright. All right. How are you doing, Jesus? Doing great. Okay, so have you been to Anime Next before, Jesus? Yep, this is my third year. Okay, and have you been Jesus for the past three years? Yes, I have. Okay. Now, can you tell me why at every con I go to, I always see a Jesus? Not a clue. He's just a famous person. 
Ah, I see, I see. So, what do you think about Anime X? What do you think distinguishes it from other cons? It's different, it's fun, it's got a lot of things to do. Uh -huh. Can you tell me where you're from? Massachusetts. Ah, I see, I see, I see. Have you met a lot of friends here? Oh yeah, many. Okay, okay. Well, I have one quick question for you. If you were to murder someone, how would you do it and why? How would I do it and why? Definitely a stab in the eye. I see, I see. Um, well, thank you for the interview, Jesus. We're here in Anime Next on Saturday, June 21st. Uh, Please state your name and what uh, what character you're cosplaying as. Uh, well, my name is Rick Konza, and I'm cosplaying Shinigami-sama from Soul Eater. Alright, is this your first Anime Next convention or your first convention ever? Well, this is my first Anime Next. I've been to conventions since 2005. Pretty much, what do you like about Anime Next this weekend? Do you like that, like it's bigger, better, or like what do you think about it, like this this year's Anime Next? Well, the whole multiple hotel thing is new to me, but I, I it's I find it interesting, and I'm I'm trying I'm getting the idea of where to go, when to go, but I think with this convention you need, you need to know the schedule to get your way around. All right, um, just like on a, like uh, regarding about like your cosplay costume. How long did it take you to actually do? Well, I started I started the mask about a month ago, and it didn't take long for me to do the mask. And then I just I found a lot of stuff in my house for it, and it worked out. That ended up working out. And I used uh, the fabric, I mean the uh, uh, foam from couches to make this the couch foam. All right, for anyone that is thinking about cosplaying, uh, like like doing their own costumes, what's the best advice you can get them? Well, this is actually the first costume I've ever done on my own. And I think it just takes, you have to take a devotion to it. You have to actually not, met, like, not joke around. You have to actually, uh, no procrastination. Just keep doing your costume. How exactly do you balance out uh, watching anime and not being a complete fat ass? Um. Um, my name is Sarah, and I'm playing Isabella from Paradise Kiss. Uh, my name is Akane Sawatome, and I'm playing Yukari from Paradise Kiss. Why these guys? Why not anybody else? Um, I've liked Paradise Kids for a really long time and I finally got around to actually making the costume. There's so many to choose from, you just have to choose. Um, I'm not exactly sure. I'm not a pretty big... I She showed me the show, I fell in love with it, but I also needed to find one. Um, I had bought some boots to, buy, to wear, and I finally have a reason to wear them now. Oh, okay. Ernie? Yeah. I think he's rather Filipino. I'm Harry Kim, and I'm cosplaying as Jedi from Naruto. Okay, and you are? I'm Ria Fernando. I am cosplaying as Conan from Naruto. All right, now why are these guys from Naruto? Why not Bleach? Uh, because I think I, ident I identify more with Jedi just based on his characteristics and his character. Okay, how about you? I love origami, so she's big for her origami and stuff. Oh, that looks pretty nice yeah. right now. How long did it take you to do those? Um, this one not too long, maybe like 10 minutes, because uh, I do it a lot. How come you don't have those? <laughs> like put them on the end of your hair over here, <laughs> and little dangly, like little pom-poms? Because that's what she uses to kill me in the series. Oh, so. okay. <laughs> yeah, that you, makes it. You don't want him dead yet. Oh, okay. <laughs> true, true. Spoiler alert. Oh. <laughs> Spoiler right there. Now, um... What like how are you have are you having a good time here at Anime Next? Yeah. It's like, fun. What, what's the best part about this weekend? Uh, I think just seeing all the different people make their costumes. It's really fun to see other people like us who like to dress up and stuff. Okay. Now I'm um, I can't tell from your costumes, but I need to ask, what is your favorite anime? <laughs> I can't tell, you know. Gee, I, need... <laughs> I wonder. <laughs> yeah, I'd be hard pressed not to say not at all. Not at all. Not at all. Now, do we have to do that little flair? It can't be Naruto. That's me, Naruto. <laughs> I feel like I'm Spanish saying that Naruto. Yeah. Give it to the
But what is the highlight for the week outside with you, Chris? When I uh, showed Ray my ass. <laughs> okay. See, we don't have that on film, but how about the actual, like, the convention itself? Oh, I really did enjoy the uh, yeah, showing my ass. Oh my oh, god, that's, that's awesome. a mouse! That's a real mouse! Yeah, that's is that a real mouse? Oh, that's a little guy. <laughs> that was awesome! <laughs> There's an actual awesome. mouse in here. Rats. They're yeah. awesome. Oh, I want to be the rat king. <laughs> Look at all the here in the Holiday Inn at Anime Next 2008. Now I'm here with three individuals. Can you tell me your names and who you're cosplaying as? Um, I'm Zach, and I'm cosplaying as a Special Ops Anbo from Naruto. I'm Bruno. I'm cosplaying as Sasori from Naruto. And I am Dan from uh, Hidon from Naruto as well. Ah, so all you guys are from Naruto. Now, have you guys been to Anime Next before? Yeah, I came last summer with my friends. Um, I've been to one in December. I've uh, been to four so far. Ah, cool, cool. So all you are from different, uh, t uh, different times. So all you guys are from Naruto, how did you guys get involved with that? Like just anime-wise? Uh, anime-wise, anything. Um, me, personally, I just like the whole kind of special ops, you know, very secretive, hide behind walls, do missions, you know, so that's how I chose it. Well, I don't know, just watching TV, and, you know. <laughs> I just like... Uh, I remember watching Card Captors when I was 12 or 6 or something. I was really young, so been an, in the anime world for a long time. Ah, uh, cool. That just cool. makes it all... <laughs> I was going to Kamehameha, and I'm, that's what hooked me to anime. All right, cool, cool. All right, so what do you guys think uh, Think about anime next? Like it, hate it, what are the highlights? Uh, best highlights, I would have to say, is probably Manhunt, cosplay Manhunt, which we do personally. It's not a regular event. Or just mostly probably all the sword fighting, because at regular events, you know, regular uh, anime conventions, they lock you inside, and you really can't do anything. But out here, you're free to, free to do what you want, and you can, like, sword fight and stuff, and that's, like, the best, I would have to say. Yeah, I'll like say like the outside is the best. <laughs> yep, uh, it's an outdoor con, which is always awesome, and they actually have really good metal concerts every year. Despair's Ray, uh, one, uh, <laughs> one twenty twelve. You know, it's really awesome. All right, cool, cool. Now, last and final question: If you guys or your characters were to murder somebody, who would you murder and how? Probably any um, other ninja, depending on missions or if whatever it came down to. Um. People who swing their sword hard for no reason, yes, I'll probably torture them slowly. I'll stick to my script and kill Ozma, who's my mortal enemy. Uh, my name is Maura Burns, I'm from Bethesda, Maryland, and I'm dressed up as Avatar Kyoshi from the TV series Avatar The Last Airbender. Okay, now do you know what your costume's like made of? Like the, which yes, it's, of? Mostly, it's mostly cotton, the only exception is these parts here are silk to peony. Uh, okay. And then a little bit of vinyl for uh, contrast. Well, how, about your, how about the headpiece? The headpiece is um, polystyrene covered in thin sheets of vinyl. And the fans are uh, vinyl window blinds covered with the same stuff. Oh. This is all made by a woman named Teresa Dietzinger, not made by me. Oh, okay. <laughs> now, um, what, like, how do you like it here so far at Anime Next? Sorry? How do you like it here so far at Anime Next? Oh, uh, this is my fifth year attending Anime Next, and, and this is going to be my fourth year judging the cosplay competition. Oh, so, uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, so okay. I've, I've been around for a while. Yeah, <laughs> like, what makes you keep coming back? Well, other than judging the cosplay competition. I have a lot of friends who are on staff. I have a lot of good friends who come here and so for some of them this is the only con they come to so it's a terrific uh, opportunity for me to hook up with people I normally don't see. Oh, okay, that's so. good. Now it's just like, like, is there like something that would make you like come back other than your friends, like other than the cosplay competition? Like would you come back normally if you didn't have any of those? I probably would actually. This is one of the, um, I think, best run cons around. They have certainly one of the best technical mask masquerades, which um, means means a lot to me. They're technical people, know what they're doing. Like you can get lighting cues, you can get sound cues, stuff oh, stuff you can't get at a lot of cons. So it's it's uh, it's special as far as that goes. But if you, if I saw an old woman naked, I'd be horrified because stop it. <laughs> is Anthony, cosplaying as Mr. Game & Watch from Smash Brothers. Now why this? 
Um, it actually started as a joke. You can relax. Yeah. My uh, sister was like complaining she can't cosplay as Mr. Game and Watch, her favorite character. I'm like, sure you can, it's really easy. Just do this, this, and this. And she didn't want to, but the more I thought, well, hey, that'd be really cool and easy to do. So here it is. Now what is it? It's all made out of cardboard? Or cardboard space? and Velcro together. So like you can kind of see my arm here. I've got a armband with Velcro on it. So when I want to take a break, it just rips off, and I can move normally again. So, and as a first prototype, it's uh, holding together reasonably well. It looks like it. Was this your first day here at the convention? my first day in costume. Yeah. Yeah. So what do you think of this so far? Well, this is my first anime next. It's all right. It seems a bit smaller than I'm used to. I'm used to like Otakon size, but it's been a lot of fun so far. <laughs> Go kiss the makeup! Yes, yes! We kissed him. We put the kissing and the making up. <laughs> <laughs> now, we're doing good juice. Duh. Okay! Oh, 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 oh. And no winner. That's the. I'm gonna. Damn it. Let's go. Oh my god, this is not an interview. Not an interview at all! Who are you? Okay, you go first. I'm Luffy, of course, One Piece, and I'll be the Pirate King. I'll be King of the Pirates. I'm Zolo Rorunoa, and I'm gonna be the... I'm gonna kill Mihawk, okay? And no one will stop me. Alright, yeah. now why these guys? Because they're the best. Because... Well, technically Mihawk's not the best, I'm the best. But oh, people yes. say he's the best, because the directors say he's the best, but I'm the best, because I say I'm the best. And because Luffy says that. Because I'm going to be king of the pirates, yeah. too. Yo, 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 yo,
What about you? Uh, I'd kill Kira because I really need to kill him. I'd <laughs> I'd probably have him hang. Yeah. <laughs> like really slow. Slow. And Okay, so I have someone <laughs> push them off a building, but they survive. They get up, walk into the street, and they get hit by a truck. Yeah. And that's all. That's all using the death note. Yes. Ah, I see. So I don't get caught. It's so easy. I'm Ashley. I'm Nick. We're uh, we're just pirates. In the battle against. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Like I heard that there was like an ongoing game, uh, battle between lynchers and pirates. Who do you think is gonna win out of that? Pirates are gonna win. We were already winning. Come on, look at us. We're so much better. True. true. All right. Is this your first true. anime next like convention you've been to, or have you been to others? Since uh, 2002. I this think. is my first. Really. Alright, um, what do you guys like about Anime Next, like, as of uh, this year, or any other conventions you've been to? Um, it's a lot bigger than it used to be, I guess. It's kind of nice. It used to be, like, a really small convention, and it's really grown. It's uh, nice to see. Well, and how do you like uh, this convention? It's pretty awesome. I'm, I've, I've been to Anime Boston, and now this is my second convention. This one's still really cool. <laughs> I'm cosplaying as Giselle from Enchanted. And I'm Queen Narissa from Enchanted. Okay, now why these cosplays? Why not something else? Uh, I really love the movie. <laughs> and I uh, originally made it for a con that was going on in New York City, and I wanted it to be appropriate, and I keep wearing it because I love it so much. Okay, how many uh, pretty much the same reason I really love the movie because it was a Disney movie. Like, I had lost faith in Disney movies that they were going to suck, but this one, like, brought my hope back. And yeah, and I wanted to be, always wanted to be a villain. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> now, um, now, why are you wearing this to an anime convention? We kind of wanted to wear them again because we wore them to a comic convention before and uh, we didn't really get a whole lot of time in them. And we put a lot of work into them, so we wanted to do it again. And uh, a lot of fans of animation are really good fans of, you know, like Disney and any kind of genre that's basically the same. So it kind of all rolls together and we get people around who recognize us, so it's really all that's worth it. Okay, now, how you liking it so far? What, do you, what, is the, what is the fans' response so far to you guys? Are you getting a lot of pictures taken? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> positive. I think people are more surprised that people are dressing up as like American animation. Like, what are you doing at an anime convention? How dare you? But no, it's not like that. People are surprised by it. They really like the stuff. It's sort of like taken, from, taken by shock, basically. Yeah. yeah. Okay. It's mostly positive, yeah. which is great. Okay. We're both cosplaying the same person, actually. Sago from Inuyasha. She's the battle version, and I'm the everyday wear version. Yeah. Well, I like her. She's my favorite character, or one of my favorite characters, and she's badass. Yeah. She's got a really cool personality, and I kind of resemble her and have the same hair. And I don't. People, I've noticed that a lot of people try to do the village of cosplays, but they kind of half-ass it. So I decided that I was going to do like a hardcore, intense, detailed version. My name is Tysir, and I am cosplaying as Alucard from Helsing, the Helsing series. Okay, now do you often get confused with Carmen San Diego? Once this morning. Oh, okay. Once this morning, that was by it. by people who don't really know anime, or is it like... I think it was purposely. I don't know if it was by accident. Oh, okay. Now why this? Why not, say, like, Darth Vader? You know? Well, um, I like the anime Helsing. And, I don't know, I feel that Darth Vader is not really, you know, it's not really toward the anime thing. Well, that's, a, yeah, that's a fair assessment. So, I mean, at an anime convention, I would like to blend in, I suppose, with the crowd, but at the same time, look flashy, so. Uh, not bad. Not don't mind me, Chris. Yeah, I'm Hello, we're here at Anime Next 2008 with a very, very sexy Peter Torrent. 
Uh, that's not my name, but that's okay. You uh, fucked up already. I did. <laughs> no, this is Dexter, aka our good friend John O'Dell. Hello, I'm Dexter. Okay. I'm a genius. Okay. Ah. I like to say omelette du fromage. <laughs> <laughs> omelette du fromage. So, what are we going to live for? Yeah. Dexter. Omelette du fromage. <laughs> <laughs> Did you embarrass yourself to do? Like, watch TV? Right. I, I watch TV. Dexter, all right, all right, all right. What, what are you waiting for at this point? <laughs> Huh? What are you on line for? I'm on line for the masquerade, of course. Really? Or, I thought it was LineCon 2008. Oh, LineCon 2008? No, I was. Uh, I, I, yeah, it was really surprised. I mean, I just kind of popped down here, you know, and then, oh, masquerade. Yeah. I, I guess LineCon 2008 must be over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I ask you, what type of deodorant are you having? Because, I gotta say, do, do I, your arm, no, my nose has been in your <laughs> pit this whole time. I haven't smelled a thing. You smell great. Yeah, I use that Axe stuff. It's pretty good. Really? Oh, Axe? Axe, yeah. So, so. So, okay, let's, let's get all of us in the shop. Uh, yeah, yeah, okay, okay. These so, are my good buddies. Uh, so, uh, have you been masquerade before? Uh, no, this is going to be my first masquerade. Oh, really? At, at any con. Yeah. At any con? At any? Yeah, yeah. I've never been to a masquerade. Do you know no, that they'll just make you wait online again? Really? Like, until the end of the masquerade, that's it. Is that it? Is, is, that, is, that, is that the end? I mean, That's the whole masquerade. I, you see, it's fake. It's a masquerade. It's a masquerade. It's a, it's a masquerade. 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 It's a ma yes. masquerade. Yes, that's it. So, just to clear a few things up, I'd just like to announce John Angolia is gay.